of our reporters, WJCL 22 News is Lydia Blackstone. She has been seeing uh, some serious conditions all morning long. She's been down in Jeff Davis County. Yeah, she's in Hazelhurst right now. Actually had to go inside. It's getting really unsafe there. And Lydia, what can you tell us about some of the conditions there right now? Emma Frank, I can't see the conditions right now. We've opened the door, but even when you open the door, you get a huge blast of wind. And so you immediately close it because we're sheltering in place in the emergency management offices here in Hazelhurst. And so what we are seeing, what we have been seeing is very, very catastrophic conditions when it comes to trees falling, power lines exploding. We keep hearing sounds on top of the roof. We know that when the sun comes out, when we walk through these doors, it's going to be a whole different place out there right now because of just so much that has came down because of the high force winds and this high force storm that's came through this area, especially where I'm at at Jeff Davis County and, and Alma that I was in earlier. So those are both two areas uh, that really saw the brunt of this right here. But we also have some really sad news to share in the sense of three people we know in this area in Georgia have passed away because of tornadoes and trees falling. We know two uh, that was in a county just right over in Wheeler County and then the county that I'm in right now in Jeff Davis one just down the road from me a mobile home. Both of those were mobile homes that people were in which just continues to enforce you know those not being safe and people um, people's lives um, being lost tonight. So it's definitely a, a somber atmosphere in here with a, a bunch of other for, first responders that want to leave this building and go help people, but can't because it's unsafe right now. So we're just sheltering in place and we'll continue to bring you updates from here, but we're still hearing the storm move over us here. Emma, Frank. Yeah, and certainly, uh, Lydia, praying for those families, you can tell just how awful the conditions have gotten there because even some of your signal, it's going in and out, um, even with y'all being inside. So I'm glad that y'all are safe, and, you know, hopefully as the sun comes up, we can learn a little bit more about the damage out there. Thanks so much. We'll check in with you in a little bit.